Happy May Day. Things looking bright and cheery to kick off the new month of May. Uh, certainly oh, an improvement over the weather we had over the weekend. We had some uh, rather windy and unsettled conditions over the weekend. But uh, right now as we look outside, a fairly serene picture uh, with our Lewiston Auto Live camera right now. Uh, temperatures uh, right at this point in the 30s to run 40 degrees as we look at the satellite radar. Storm system pulling away to the east. Did have some pretty gusty winds and some raw, uh, unsettled conditions yesterday with the rain and some snow showers. That system has moved down to the east. Rainfall amounts uh, not all that impressive. This is total for the entire weekend. As we've been saying, it was going to be unsettled. It's going to be a little wet and windy. Not excessive rainfall, and that's a good thing. We did have uh, something in the rain gauge. It was still Rochester, almost a quarter inch, 24 hundredths of an inch official at RST. Hoka, a uh, quarter inch. Beaver, a little more than a quarter inch. Lake City, 17 hundredths of an inch in Austin. Just barely a measurable amount, two hundredths of an inch. Temperatures in the 40s all through yesterday and last evening. Now those numbers have dropped to the 30s with a cold round of sunshine and more of that uh, chilly breeze. Winds make it feel like it's about 30 or upper 20s at this point. Uh, actual temperature of 37 at the Rochester Airport, Austin 39. It's 39 in Decorah and 41 in Charles City, Iowa. It feels like 27. The winds 20 miles per hour here in Rochester. 37. The actual temperature air pressure is falling 29.63 inches of mercury. Windy and cool today. Winds at times 30 to 35 miles per hour. Keep in mind yesterday it was 45 miles per hour. So an improvement there, but still that nuisance with us still that, that annoying wind. It'll be with us today and really even tomorrow. Not as strong each day, a little less windy every day, a little bit warmer. So a couple of trends are going in a better direction, but overall still very spring like in many ways. And the weekend does feature some showers. There's another trend that's been with us a weekend featuring some rain this time around. The best chance of rain will be over the weekend. Once again, storm system pulling away to the east. You have high pressure coming in to replace it from the west ahead of it. Some gusty winds for today and tomorrow as we get closer to that high pressure. Finally, then we get to enjoy lack of wind. 37 in Rochester at this point. It's 38 in Wausau. 39 in uh, St. Cloud, and there are some 20s west, Valentine, Nebraska, uh, in the heart of Cherry County, in northern Nebraska. There it's only 28, and uh, Pierce, South Dakota, 28. Some sunshine, some passing clouds, a brisk breeze, rather gusty at times, a high of 51 today. Sunset at 8.13, a temperature tracker for the rest of today. 50s for a time in the afternoon and early evening, uh, still rather gusty. And even tonight, as we ease back into the 40s and 30s, we're going to still deal with wind. It won't be quite 35 miles per hour, as will be the case during the day, but still 25 mile per hour gusts common through the overnight hours and much of tomorrow before we finally see things approved tomorrow evening. But right now, high pressure uh, coming in behind that departing storm system. At first, a few passing clouds with some sunshine today. Tomorrow, extra sunshine uh, with uh, not quite as much of that breeze, but still mid 50s for high temperatures. And finally, on Wednesday, as we've been saying, less wind, more sun. 60s finally come back. We're talking about some more 60s for the latter part of the week as there is more energy for the West, producing very small rain chances at first Thursday and Friday. Better chances lie ahead for the weekend itself, mostly on Sunday. Uh, today, partly sunny skies, a gusty northwest breeze. Look at those numbers, though. Low 50s in Rochester, 55 Mason City, and 54. Red Wing better than the 40s we had yesterday, but still more than 10 degrees cooler than the seasonal average. Tomorrow, mid 50s. Rochester and in Preston, 59 meanwhile in Mason City. Temperature tracker for the next seven days. We have mostly 60s, vast majority of that se uh, seven day outlook uh, looking more seasonable. So improvement is ahead uh, today. Uh, it's Monday, you know, what'd you expect, right? It's the beginning of May and sometimes it gets worse than this, but uh, this is at least a sunnier version of what we had over the weekend. 51, partly sunny northwest winds on the strong side. 36 tonight, still breezy, still cold. Seven day forecast dry until Maybe Thursdays. There's a small chance of a brief shower or two. And same deal Friday. And then Saturday, not a wash. That's not going to be that much. A hit or miss shower here and there. Sunday does look like by far the wettest, the wettest of the next several days with a little thunder involved. But still some pretty decent uh, May temperatures. Okay. Well, make sure those May Day baskets are well secured when yes. you drop them off. I know. I, you have to watch out for those <laughs> because it's, it's yeah windy weather out there. Yeah, yeah. Don't want to lose those treasures. No. <laughs> <laughs> it is 6.30.